Hi, I'm Diane. In this segment, we're going to focus on blush. As you can see, I'm all ready except for my blush. And I'm going to show you some tips how to put it on like a pro, and you'll see how it just completes the whole look. For this segment, I'm going to use a special tool, this brush, and I'm going to load it up with the blush. And I'm going to go ahead and get enough of it on. Most people make the mistake of putting it on like right here and going up like this. But if you've watched the pros do it, to give me a lift, I'm going to put it on high and start pull it down. And the key to really fabulous brush is blending, blending, blending. So you also don't want to go in beyond your pupil or below your nose so that this stays high. Now, another little secret that I learned was to pull some of this blush to pull a nice complete look up on your forehead here. Just a little bit here on the edge and also right here under your neck. Now remember, this kind of cosmetic makeup is just to help create a little shadow, an illusion, and just finish that look. So once you see where, what I've done and how I do it, I'm going to show you the other side. Also, I always go like this and blend so you don't see any harsh lines. So this one, you're going to make the brush go down. Okay, now. I don't know if you can see with that light like this, but look at the difference just in the two sides. It's a, a slight little hint. And if I pull this up, you can see where I've put it. Just a little bit here, a little bit here, and a little bit here. I also, when I was doing my eyeshadow, pulled a little bit right up in here. So let me go ahead and I'll do the other side. And what it does, it actually like almost gives me a facelift for free. <laughs> so load up the brush with some color. Start up high near your temples and apply it. Now remember your skin has to be properly prepared before you start adding color or it's going to sink more in and be harder to move around. But this way it's just sitting right on top and it's just powder and if you put a little too much on so what? You can put on some powder afterwards. But this is going to help uh, elongate to make my face appear thinner. Now, of course, if you have a super long face, there will be different techniques for you. Again, blend here so you don't see the lines. And now just a hint. You don't want people to say, wow, Look at that blush. Look at her makeup. Just, oh, doesn't she look fresh and lovely. So there you go.